So today I'm just going to be doing a new video. It is called a buy and try. And for those of you who do not know what a buy and try is, it is pretty much I'm going to be taking, personally I'm going to be taking three products, three different products, and I'm going to be trying them out for the month and then reviewing them back to you guys. And then the next half of the video will be me introducing three new products that I'm going to be trying out. And then the cycle will just continue. I'm going to be doing them at the end of every month. So obviously it is the end of April and I've been trying out three different products for cheer and then I have three new products I'm going to be showing you guys but I also have some news I'm going to be changing my um, uploading date or not date day of the week to because like I have explained in past videos that I have cheer on Tuesdays and Thursdays and so I was like perfect I'll just make the videos on Monday and then post them on Wednesday that being said, I didn't really make the videos on Monday. I've been making them on Wednesday, uploading, editing, doing all that stuff on the day I'm supposed to be uploading. And then I make a crappy video and obviously that's not good. So I need to be making better quality videos. So I thought that if I had Monday to film or Wednesday to film and then I can slowly edit and make them really, really good quality for you guys, that'll be so much better. Also next week, this isn't like trying to scare you guys but next week I am going to be going to the summit I am NOT competing I'm just going because I have family down there and I need to visit them and then my other cousin that lives here and cheers at my gym is going there so we're just gonna make a trip out of it and go visit my cousins that I haven't seen for like over a year so I'm super excited about that um, my cousins also do cheer um, but that being said I don't know if I'm gonna have access to Wi-Fi so we'll see how that uploading process will go. I will be definitely uploading one on like a random day of the week and then also so I'll be posting two videos on the following week if I can't get my whatever video it is up. Um, that being said I would love so much if I got to meet some of you guys um, so just comment on this on this video you can definitely check me out on my new Twitter I'll explain that at the end of this video but follow me on my Twitter and Instagram and you can comment on any of my photos I posted or DM me on Twitter and stuff, but I'll explain all of my social media at the end of this video. But without further ado, let's just get into the video. Okay, so for the past month now, I got three new products. And so the first one is this hairspray. It is called Chia. Um, I can't pronounce this. Enviro, Enviro 54 hairspray. Firm hold. It looks like that. It is so 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 nice it is kind of expensive I think my mom got it at TJ Maxx so it was a little bit cheaper but um yeah it works really 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 well it definitely holds my tees the second thing I have is a NYX roll on shimmer okay so I bought this for the intention of getting like what do you call it like those highlight so I do have like a highlighting kit but um, those ones do not work as well as this. And obviously in cheer it is acceptable to have glitter on your face. So I just got this roll on shimmer and it definitely brings out your eyes and like it's really easy. It's just swipe and then rub it in and then be done. Instead of like taking glue, putting it on or doing the highlight thing which is not even strong enough. So these NYX roll on shimmers, they have them in so many colors, are great. The last thing is I was last month I was looking for a headband that wouldn't like slip at practice like these Lululemon headbands oh my gosh I cannot tell you how many times I've been at practice and just have them fly off when I'm doing a full out but so I went out and got these Under Armour headbands I, there's like it says Under Armour on it it's probably not gonna be able to focus on it but it, it is the best thing ever it, but Oh my gosh, these ones stay on. They will not fall off your head unless you like rip it off. And the great thing about this is like I've had some rubber headbands where if you pull it out, it rips out your hair. This one doesn't do that at all. It's like a nice smooth texture, but then super rubbery. So it's super, super grippy. So it won't fall out, but won't pull out any hair. It's so nice. Now on to the three products I'll be trying out. So I was at Bartell Drugs. You can probably get this all at like Rite Aid. Um, Target, all those kind of like pharmaceutical, like what, are, what drug stores. That's what it's called. 
Um, so the first thing I picked up was a soft and dry clinical protection deodorant. And it is not like your regular like deodorant. It's like supposed to keep you fresh and keep you dry. This is my struggle. I'm one of those girls, and I'm going to be blatantly honest here, that gets a lot of moisture under my arms. And so when I go to practice and I'm wearing like a gray shirt, I, it shows through. So I was looking for something, and we're going to try this out. The next thing I got was this L'Oreal Pro Spray and Set. So what this is, is you just take it and you mist a little bit on your, on your face. And to let it dry, it dries super, super quick right now. This is the first time I'm trying it out, by the way, obviously. And it's oh, soaked in pretty well. Um, and it's supposed to keep your makeup lasting a long time. So we'll see how that works out at practice because my makeup does tend to sweat off. The last thing I have is this 24 hour, hour, 24 hour concealer and it's from Maybelline. And I got it in the color cream. But we'll just see how this stays because I just said that I sweat off my makeup in practice and so need better concealer. Okay, and then like I said at the beginning of this video about my social media, Insta, and Twitter, I have just recently created a whole new Twitter account just for cheer because I did not want to blow up all my school friends with, like, cheer stuff. That'd just probably be annoying. So you guys should definitely go check that out in the down bar. I have my link to that Twitter account. And then also, for that reason, I really, 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 really want to do a Q&A. So once I hit 500 followers on Twitter, then I will be doing a Q&A. You guys can DM me, just tweet me, and ask me some questions about my personal life. And then also, I'm going to be doing a giveaway for my subbies, my subscribers. Um, so I'm not going to be doing it yet, but I've created a goal for us. We're going to be trying to hit 1,000 subscribers by August, what was it? August 1st. So that gives us four solid months to hit a thousand subscribers. So this means you guys need to be telling your cheer friends, telling everyone you know to come check out my channel, obviously like teenagers, yeah, the do cheer, to come check out my channel and subscribe to it so that you guys, so I can give back to you guys as you guys give back to me. So anyway, thank you for watching. I'm sorry if this like talking portion, like the intro and the end was kind of long but I wanted to tell you guys all this information and yeah I hope you enjoy this video and I'm gonna be posting these every month like I said so that's it bye guys